This is a quick review of a tripod I bought. This is a Vista by Davis and Stanford, Stanford rather, Explorer tripod. I do a digital photo. Yeah, that's what the carton looks like. It, oh, it was an Amazon purchase. It was packed pretty well. They had it packed in the box just slightly bigger. Unfortunately, the only thing negative about the packaging is the box is quite a bit longer than the, than the uh, box that was inside. So this box is bouncing around back and forth, you know, shaking the side of this box pretty badly. It would have been nice if I would have thrown those air cushion things on either side of it. Um, but it arrived uh, in a timely manner, in good condition. Came right from Amazon Fulfillment, obviously. Uh, I've had a chance to use it most of this summer. Well, I bought it about half of this through summer. So it's been uh, on my mountain bike. It's been on my canoe, in my canoe. It's been in the water. It's uh, been on the handlebars banging around. It's very light duty. It's light period, which is a good thing. Um, this is only about a $20 purchase. Kind of amazing. Uh, for the quality of it, actually, because it could do just about everything a tripod should do. It's got that adapter plate thing that attaches to the bottom of your camera. I guess a lot of tripods have that. Um, so you take it off with your camera. I guess your camera on and off easy, unless you attach the adapter plate to your camera easy. The thing you got to remember, though, is to keep it with it, though. So you take your tripod out with you someplace and you're doing the plate with you, you're kind of SOL, it doesn't really do any good. So that's something to think about. I just saw another YouTuber watching his video saying, oh, I'm not shooting this on a tripod because I don't want my adapter plate to my tripod, it's somewhere else. Um, so pretty good quality, thin aluminum and plastic. I guess my only really concern about it is how it's going to hold up in the winter if I take it out in the winter mainly because of these type of uh, foot uh, locks that it has on the uh, feet. These are kind of nice though. They just flip open. They're quick, you know, these little levers that just flick. Spread her out. And what's nice about having them released like that is if you're on uneven ground, set it up like that, and then just go and click these little guys. And good enough. You know, the rest you can get with uh, all these other adjustments you got. Do a slow up. Not very noisy, pretty quiet. Slight noise to it. You don't hear the car going by. It's got a uh, level gauge here. Also got a level gauge uh, here. And I set it up almost exactly level just by uh, dropping the feet like that. So it gets you quite a bit of height. I'm a six foot one person. I never want to go. I probably want taller, but it's a practicality. And like I said, I expected it to uh, get a few dents. It hasn't gotten any dents in it yet. Um, you know, banging around on, on the uh, handlebars of my bicycle, my mountain bike, or uh, being bounced around a the canoe. There's really no wear or tear on it yet. Two or three months of heavy use, well, not heavy use, moderate use. So that's about it. That's about to show it off. Not much excuse for a YouTuber not to have a tripod. Uh, you know, when you can get it for 20 bucks. Good, serviceable tripod. So, no complaints. Decent tripod for 20 bucks.
it didn't really show up on the uh, video, but it actually had that set on the one leg was set up on this little hill here. Um, gosh, the camera sure flattens things out. It's kind of surprising you can't see this hill very well. But the one leg was set up in the hill, that's why I dropped the legs and locked them. I was just kind of demonstrate how that kind of works quick and easy in getting this thing set up level. I do have a second tripod of sorts, and I did a review on this earlier. It's part of, it's in the uh, 35 watt LED review. I, I gave you a bonus review on this guy too. Um, I showed where I got it from, the same company I got the light from. I think it's Kinco or somebody like that off of eBay. Um, Kimco or Kinco was the dealer. You can go look at my uh, 35 watt LED uh, review if you want to see the full review on this one. But I really love this thing. It's only about six bucks. It turns into a tripod, a mini tripod. The legs snap up. There's a little lock there. And you can sit it like that and of course you can level it. But better yet you can use this clamp. And that's been super handy on so many things. In fact I shot this uh, part of this review using this tripod. So this is like my favorite because it's just cheap and easy and a million uses. Also recommended.